Happy winter solstice. Our shortest amount of time in daylight of the entire year is today. 726 your sunrise, 520 the sunset in Columbia. This is what we know about the winter solstice, right? That's the obvious stuff. But how about winter as a season? Well, on average, our coldest time of the year is mid January and our best chance of snow. A question I get asked all the time. It's historically late January and then we have another peak in mid to late February for snowfall. But even though January is our coldest month of the year, and February is only the third coldest on average. We look at February for pretty much everything when it comes to winter extremes. So we're still several weeks away from, you know, the potential core of winter. Our coldest high temperature on record in the 1800s, 16 degrees. That's what did it. It was February 12th, February 14th for our coldest morning low on record in Columbia. And our snowiest day, you don't have to go too far back, 1973, we picked up over a foot of snow. And that was also in February. So February is a little bit of a wild month. As far as snow goes, though, in the Midlands, we do start to see the opportunity for it in late December. Obviously, that's not the case this year, but we do also have peaks in late January as well as February in the middle to end of the month. We picked up 12 snow days in mid February and eight days of snow in late February. These records go back to 1887, so I really had to fish for them because we only see an average of five out of every 1,000 days of snowfall in January and six out of 1,000. Your odds only very slightly better in the month of February. So be odds of seeing snow in the Midlands is relatively small and we know that because it's been years since we have seen the white stuff here and so far this winter has been a very mild one that's right meteorological winter starts on December 1st that's when the record keeping begins and we are five degrees above average for our December afternoon highs and if you're not a fan of winter here's some more good news we're gaining more daylight after today in the evenings, we've already seen an extra four minutes of daylight. We've still been losing daylight in the morning time. We'll continue to lose our daylight through January 9th in the morning. We lose two minutes, but by then we gain 13 minutes of daylight in the evening time. And then by January 21st, we gain 25 minutes of daylight just a month from now in the evening time. For News 19, I'm meteorologist Alex Calamia.